Never, never thought it would happen. This Whitefish Bay homeowner, who doesn't want his name used, says around 1 a.m. his wife woke him up because she heard someone in their home near Fairmount and Diversity. And came downstairs, heard the door shut uh, as I was coming downstairs, looked out the front window and saw both cars pulling out. His two cars stolen right in front of him. I think the car was either too close to the house where the fob was inside uh, or they jimmied the car, I don't really know. Uh, but I had left my house keys inside in the council. Officers chased the teen burglars into Milwaukee. The suspect driving the Audi lost control and plowed right into this fence on the corner of 14th and Keefe. Their SUV was found abandoned near Parkway and Glendale. Two 15-year-olds were arrested, but a few others ran off. The chief of Whitefish Bay Police says this year they've had 100 car break-ins, and 90% of the time, the cars were unlocked. This homeowner now warning others to not make the same mistake he did. Make sure you're locking your car every night. If you can put it in your garage, put it in your garage. Be vigilant about your, where your house keys are. But despite the break-in and stolen cars, he says it's all about perspective. Nobody was hurt, and at the end of the day, that's all that's important. In Whitefish Bay, Hillary Mintz, WISN 12 News. And police say they're still looking for two or three other teenagers involved in this burglary. The thieves also stole the homeowner's wallet as well as purse.